Ladies and gentlemen, uh, my name is Albert Kapala from Tanzania. Uh, today I'm going to introduce to you the software called CS Pro. And uh, this introduction I'm going to cover the, 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 the two major parts that is what is CS Pro and the features that are available in CS Pro. Uh, starting with the definition of CS Pro, uh, this one is the sensors and survey processing system is a software package for entry, editing, tabulating, and dissemination of the sensors and survey data. CS Pro combines the features of integrated microcomputer processing system and the integrated system for survey analysis in a window environment. CS Pro have got uh, three major features. Uh, these are data entry applications, batch edit applications, and uh, tabulation applications. We shall see the, 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 the subpart uh, of each part of CS Pro features. Mean that under batch uh, under data entry application we've got some subparts then we shall see them later on the same applies for tabulation applications and the batch edit application under uh, this series of videos we are going to be guided by the set of tutorials we are going to have around the eight tutorials uh, the first one is on data entry application how to create data entry application the other one is on how to create the data dictionary and also we shall learn how to create the data entry forms apart from that we shall cover some logic checks it means that under this one we are going to, to, to learn how to write the logic checks how to control errors how to control the consistency of information and also we are going to learn how to key to enter data into the computer using the, 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 the software and then under this one we shall learn how we can add the cases how we can modify how we can delete them and also the last three major parts under this set of tutorials are going to be on how to tablet data how to produce tables how to modify the tables and also how we can run the batch application so thank you